no, ain't nobody here created for himself. He thinks just for pleasure. Ain't nobody created nothing for just for pleasure. The world is too hard to create a man just for pleasure. That's a cruel world. I've been living out here on the street 30 years. I learned, I've seen a lot of stuff that the normal eyes can't see. I started living like a, a animal. And by living like an animal, I began to see a lot of supernatural stuff that a normal human can't see. He's a street person. It's like walking Jesus and we're all his disciples. <laughs> walks around and talks to people and he kind of scares me. And he'll say, if I'm bothering you, you just tell me to leave. But he comes in because it's cold outside. You know, in the wintertime, he comes in to get warm. And we let him come in and sit for, you know, half hour, 40 minutes or so. And he'll get warm and then he'll leave. Um, well, he don't hurt nobody, but he's getting old now. He's, because I even asked him, I said, you know what, Willie? They tell me that you eat rats and mice. He says, yeah, when I was younger, he said, I did. But... He says, I can't anymore, and I asked him why, and he says he's too slow to catch him. He can't catch him anymore. Willie's got money. Willie's money's hit. Yeah. Willie's had money since forever, man. 72, I heard. 72. He's actually from Africa. He is the only person in all of Peoria that can literally go into any bar that he wants, any hotel that he wants, any restaurant he wants to eat for free. Yep. Sure I enough. kid you not. Because that he, man can take a 40 ounce, open it up in town on the police it. station steps everybody and they won't touch it. <laughs> He's the only person, he's like the only celebrity that's, I think that's been in like Time Magazine or something like that. <laughs> he's the only homeless person that's ever done that. He's got his own website and everything, man. <laughs> Willie, Willie, that's and, my and dog. He, 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 he can go out and have a... He, the man would uh, not stand in the house. I don't care what you do. Yeah. He would not stand in the house. He's, he he's won't the type that can go out house. in public and don't care what he looks like. Seriously. <laughs> you know how most people, they can spend an hour. I mean. You know how many people have offered to, for him to freaking live with them? Man? Right, right, right. Yeah, I want to. Very polite. Never had any problems with them. Um, when you see him out on the street, it's a little bit different. He, I don't know if he's looking for attention or what, but sometimes it's like when the winter comes around, he does something to get in jail so he can have a place to stay. Other than that, he's an okay guy. Uh, I know the police won't take him anymore. It's gotten to the point where it's just like, so you threw a book through the federal building, big deal. Did he try to rob a <laughs> bank one time? And he did. He did, just to go to the county, man. That's the only reason why he does it. He are, they, are, they already know that it's around this time. Like, I bet you around this time now, he probably won't do nothing, but when it starts snowing and it's stuff, last of October. yeah, he's gonna start doing real stupid stuff just to go back to back to jail, man. He's a very, very deep man. I mean, he could be just talking like she is on her phone, and what he says, I mean, it doesn't come out as philosophical and deep. It's the kind of depth that you have to think about right. when you do you and when it hits think you. About what he it's says. like, wow, he's insightful, but on the same token, he's on the same level as me. Well, as a prisoner. 
the world see and man don't understand that the world was created by nature, not by man. And the, the creators that created this world need to think that nature produced. So actually man is defeating itself. He actually destroying the things that can take care of him in the world of the dead to build things to make him come on existence. I've known him, I've known Willie for about nine years. Yeah. I've known him for a long time. I've I, I known him a long, long I walked time. up one time on him when he was sitting on a bus bench and he was, was, he was yelling and hollering and I go, what's the matter, buddy? He goes, not a damn thing. I go, who are you yelling at? He goes, everybody. Hey, Christianity is, is okay if you want to follow belief, but it can't save nobody. It can't save itself. They live off the human dead for a short period of time until they they, it, until they die. We've talked about politics and all this stuff. He don't like to delve too far into politics, you know. His but wife left him, I think, is what happened, and then he went downhill. He, he kind of got broke up, and he got ways. pissed off society and all that stuff, and he was just out here venting. From what I understand, doing. it used to be a professor. Nature was meant to be, this here was a thoughts and theory of man, how to keep mud off your feet, uh, water off your feet, by building sidewalk. But you have prison things that nature needs by building a concrete world. See, you don't know how, what plants down there that actually the animal can eat or you can eat, that the resource that come out of those plants is for the creator to live off. The guy is pretty off the hook, man. Uh, I don't know, he's probably saner than the most of us to be able to just, you know, go out and do the things he does as actively and calmly as he does. You know, I don't know, he thinks he lives a lot freer life. He's a hell of an individual. Do you know the largest thing in this world is the hormones or the cells in your body? They actually got lives like real people. And the cells in your body need the thing, the uh, nutrition type thing that you get from plants and stuff to keep their lives alive. Yeah, a person don't actually know that his own life is a life. And when you die and ain't got no earth on your body, your life is over. Very different man. He's smart. <coughs> He's not stupid. If he was stupid, he'd have been dead a long time ago, little like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We've been Died out here. Pneumonia, we've been out here what? Eight winters. Or killed himself. Or we live out here you know in the winter saying? time. You know. He was out here. We don't go anywhere. Long, long time. We just throw it. Oh, yeah. They go. What do you do when you get cold? I go put on more clothes. Yeah, you do that. <laughs> Man got the theory that his body was created just to have pleasure. Your body was created for the waste that come off of the feces and urinate. You really don't put the first down the toilet. You put put it on the street so the flies. You actually don't put both put dead bodies in the ground. They like nasty people better than they do creators. Like nasty people better than they don't like clean people. Clean and death, but they don't like it clean in life. You destroy too much. You having the insects? You destroy by not throwing food on the ground? 